Hi, my name is Mauricio Toledo and I am a fourth year neuroscience and psychology minor. I am from Houston, Texas. So I first heard about Texas 4000 my freshman year. Uh, I was in a meeting for one of my organizations and we had a guest lecture that night and it happened to be a writer for Texas 4000. I honestly thought the guy was crazy when he said that he was biking from Austin to Alaska and I didn't pay much attention to it. But it wasn't until one of my friends, uh, Amber Palmer, she's a 2017 rider, applied and went through the whole journey of Texas 4000 that it truly became a reason for me to join. So seeing her passion, seeing her dedication, seeing her commitment to an organization that has such a meaningful not only mission but impact on the community such as cancer was something that I want to be part of. One of the reasons why I ride is for the kiddos of Kev Kesson. When a parent is diagnosed with cancer, it truly affects the whole family. I have seen this impact through my experiences and my interactions with my campers. They never fail to shock me every year when they tell me their stories. But despite all the suffering, all the grief they experience, they never lose their innocence. And that is honestly what makes Camp Kasim so magical. Their smiles are so much brighter than any kids. Their laughter is so much louder. They can honestly melt a heart, can brighten any single day with just one smile. And that's honestly what's gonna make Camp Kasim so memorable for me. Um, not that my time is done. Another reason why I ride is in memory of two people. One of them is my neighbor, Ms. Gardy. She unfortunately passed away from cancer. And her wisdom is something that will resonate in my family's hearts for the rest of our lives. And the second person is me, Tia Laurita. Um, she also passed away from cancer. And I believe that she left too soon because she left behind three beautiful kids. So what I look forward to during the ride is getting closer and getting to meet my teammates. Also, going to communities and being vulnerable with people within these communities. So hearing their stories, hearing their struggles, hearing how cancer has impacted their lives, and being able to not only share with them the knowledge that we provide um, to tech support Talisman, but also giving them hope that they're not alone, that if they're still fighting the fight against cancer, there are people on their sidelines cheering them on and making sure that they get through the journey. One of my favorite memories in Texas 4000 so far has been this past weekend. On Friday, we got to visit MD Anderson in Houston. And it was the first time we got to visit an institution that we support through our fundraising efforts. And seeing the impact our efforts have on not only the cancer community, but with the patients that they have there has truly made the mission of Texas 4000 more tangible and more direct to me personally. Um, another part of this weekend was Skills Clinic. So Skills Clinic was the first time we got to ride on our bikes. And despite me falling twice and the bruises that I probably have, it was honestly such an amazing experience. Um, the ride was amazing. It's something that I will look forward to in these coming months and in the summer specifically. I'd like to thank everybody who supported me and motivated me in my journey to Alaska. Quiero agradecerle a todos que me apoyaron y que me motivaron en mi camino a Alaska. Thank you. Gracias.